Greetings, Twin Flame Lover. Hi, it's Dr. Amanda Noel, the Twin Flame Matchmaker. You've asked, is there only one Twin Flame? What happens if your Twin Flame dies, disappears, doesn't want to be with you? I've got the answers, so stay tuned. I'm here in my backyard and there's a beautiful creek running through. And that is all twin flame love. All the flowers here are twin flame love. All the particles of my messy hair are twin flame love. All of the little birds in the meadow over there are twin flame love. There's no limitation of twin flame love from the feminine. So what do we do if our twin flame is not here for us and we still want twin flame love? It's a big problem, right? I've seen the problem get solved with this shift in consciousness. So everything in the universe is based on the divine feminine and the divine masculine, and it's where it comes together. In the masculine world, there's structure, there is form, there's limitation, laws that have to be followed. In the feminine world, there's more of a flow, an infinite energy cycle where there's no limitation, where you can have as many lovers as you want in every moment, and it's all good, it's all God. And it's when you braid these energies together into one energy, you have twin flame love. So from the masculine aspect, which is no better than the feminine aspect, there truly is only one twin flame. There's only one person that mirrors who you are. It's just destiny and fate that you're with this person. Now the second possibility, which is just as real as the first, is the very feminine aspect of twin flame love is in all beings, all particles of the universe, all aspects. The quote that I love so much is when the entire world becomes your twin flame, you are ready as a twin flame. What that means is from that deep unconditional loving place, everything's your twin flame and it doesn't matter if the person is your hottest, most delight, divinely, deliciously aligned match, or if it's just there's so much love in your heart that you can kind of activate it. You could even fall in love with a terrorist. You could be like, I see what you're doing is wrong, but I just divinely love you. And that's sort of like a twin flame love. I send terrorist love all the time, but I don't date them. However, if I were to go make love to that tree over there and be like, yeah, well, that's my twin flame. That's not exactly right. The energy behind the physicality is totally twin flame love. So when you braid the two together, the feminine and the masculine, there's the thing of, well, which one do you choose? Do you choose there's only one right way? There's only one twin flame. There's like the Bible says this and you know, it has to be this way. Or is it this other way where it's like, well, I get to choose completely from the feminine. And what I understand from my own experience and in working with hundreds of women and speaking to thousands of people on YouTube and Facebook and Pinterest and etc., there is your choice. You get to create your own reality. You get to choose whatever you believe you receive. Thoughts create things, basics in the law of attraction. You believe it and it vibrates and comes to you in physicality. So if you're someone who believes that that was your last love, you lost, they died, they left you, and you said, that's it, that was the one, I missed the bus, that's it, I enjoyed it while it lasted, I'm, I'm done. Congratulations, that's your reality. No judgment, that's fine if you wanna keep that. If you're like, oh my gosh, that love opened my heart to twin flame love. That love created a new beginning for me to love even deeper and vaster and wider, then that's your reality. It's your choice because you are the beloved. You have the freedom and you can choose to expand in the infinite, in the finite here on 3D dense earth where it's a little difficult, dark and dirty. You get to choose, you get to receive as long as you believe. So what do you choose to believe? Have the twin flame love in your heart. Twin flame love is simply divine universal love of the divine feminine and the divine masculine coming together at the heart. You deserve this, the world deserves it. The world deserves to receive it from you as the twin flame queen or king. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Namaste, namaskar. And then join me for a complimentary 75 minute training called Bring In Your Beloved Now. Avoid the three tragic mistakes smart women make that keep them lonely, stuck, and heartbroken. Mm -hmm.